Okay, so hello everyone. This video is about placing a tarpaulin in front of your vehicle. And there's my cat. Okay, this is not a video favoring one candidate or the other. So as we all know, whenever people join caravans, motorcades, or processions, most of the time they would pose a tarpaulin in front of their vehicle. Right? Something like this. Now, I don't have a tarpaulin, so just for illustration, I will just use this rug. Okay, this is just a towel that I now use as a rug. I'm sorry if my vehicle is all dirty now on that tarpaulin would be something like vote for this or vote for that or if it's a funeral procession something like in loving memory of now i would say if you can please avoid doing this because if you do you would cover this vent now this vent is not there just for aesthetic purposes see this vent is intended to let air get inside your engine bay and as it does it cools down the radiator effectively cooling down the coolant cooling down your engine i'll show you okay now that the engine is running you'll see this smoke you see see that it's getting sucked inside the engine bay that means fresh air fresh cool air is getting sucked inside the engine bay cooling down the radiator cooling down the coolant cooling down your engine you see now if you put a tarpaulin in front of your vehicle you see it's still trying to suck in air but now that airflow is obstructed. And when you do not have fresh cool air getting in, that would cause your radiator to heat up, your coolant to heat up, and in so doing, that would cause your engine to overheat. Now considering the slow pace of caravans, motorcades, or processions, and at times it takes a couple of hours, in the end, you really are going to end up damaging your engine. So if you really want to place a tarpaulin, might as well do it on top of the hood, okay? Something like that. Just imagine Mr. DIYer for president. <laughs> or say like this vehicle, as you can see, it has a bull bar and some bird sheet and my cat. Now, if I place a tarpaulin in front of this vehicle, it still is somewhat okay because as you can see, the vent is not obstructed. And it's still able to suck in fresh air from outside. You see that smoke getting sucked in? See, that means fresh air is still getting inside. Okay, so you see? Just something to take into consideration before you think of placing a tarpaulin in front of your vehicle. So join political caravans, support the candidate you like, but do so wisely, okay? Because if your engine gets damaged, do you think the candidate you are supporting will support you fix your engine? Just a question, okay? Now, before I will end this video, I would just like to say this is not about politics, okay? This is about the danger and the damage that could be done by placing a tarpaulin in front of your vehicle obstructing the vent although what inspired me to make this video is seeing pictures and videos of political motorcades but this is applicable not only for politics okay including processions and not only here but also elsewhere in the world i have a lot of viewers in america and africa very nice respectful people viewers from south america and europe new zealand and australia okay so hello to each and every one of you so like i've said this is not about politics do not turn this into something political okay do not use, please do not use my channel or the comment section to promote your candidate. I will delete that comment. Whether you're pro Lenny, pro BBM, pro Pacquiao, pro Isco, pro Laxon, or pro Bongo, okay? I will not allow that. So I will end this video here. Share this information if you want to so that we can spread awareness. And as always, thank you for watching.